sometimes people can be so woke, though, that they, they almost, like, undermine what they were trying to do in the first place. But, like, by mistake, you know? Like, a good example is, is like, one day I was walking with a group of my friends, right? A group of friends, and I was the only non-white person in the group. And then someone shouted from across the road. They were just like, hey, you monkey! And then my friend was like, oh, man, Trevor, I'm so sorry about that. <laughs> and I was like, wait, how do you know he was talking to me? <laughs> and he was like, oh, no, I, I'm... Because he said the racist thing, and, and then I was like, no, no, he said the monkey. <laughs> how do you know he was talking to me? And he was like, well, I mean, because, I mean... <laughs> it can't be any of us. Because then I was like, no, you look more monkey than I do. What are you talking about? <laughs> This is just about monkey feature. It could be anyone's a monkey. It could be the way we walk. It could be the actual monkeys behind us. It could be... <laughs> yeah, but it was just, like, a funny moment where it's, like, you know, you think you're being, like, all, oh, oh, you know, I'm... You know, there was a moment like that for me in the, um... in the Joe Kennedy rebuttal. Like, he said something that was really amazing. Don't get me wrong. It was really beautiful and amazing. But I feel like he undercut the message that him and the Democrats have been trying to create for a long time. And it was about the dreamers. I don't know if they can find the clip, but if, if they do, they'll... There's a clip of Joe Kennedy when he speaks Spanish. If you guys can try... If you, you got that? And to all the dreamers out there watching tonight, let me be absolutely clear. Ustedes son parte de nuestra historia. Vamos a luchar. Vamos a luchar por ustedes. Y no, nos vamos a alejar. You see, now, that's amazing. Like, it's amazing because it's like, yo, the guy can speak Spanish and it's, it's, it's a great moment. The only issue I have is the whole premise of the Dreamers is that they're American <laughs> just like everybody else. Now, I'm not saying Spanish is not American. I'm not, I'm not saying that. But I'm saying you've said these Dreamers are kids who have been brought to America at such a young age that they only know America. This is the only life they've ever lived. And you're like, these are Americans. They just haven't been afforded the opportunity to be born here. Their parents brought them here. They're like, they're Americans. We are Americans together. And to the dreamers, para mi, un bocadillo, por favor. Un, donde esta la biblioteca? And it's like, yeah, but you, like, why didn't you just speak to them in English as well? Do, do, like, you create... No, because now if someone else is watching, they're like, wait, I thought you said they were American. They don't speak the English? And it's like, no, no, I was speaking to them in... in oh, man, is it, do you get it? <laughs> Like, you, you undermine what you're trying... It would be the equivalent if, like, Joe Biden... If Joe Biden was giving a speech, like, during birtherism, and he was like, President Barack Obama was born in America, he was not born in Kenya! Stay strong, Barry. 